Hello Forte users, and welcome to another tutorial for our music notation program, Forte. Today we'd like to give you a brief introduction into the notation of drums and percussion instruments. Writing drum notation is basically similar to regular notation, but there are a few things that users need to keep in mind. Forte's drum notation convention is based on the most common notation for drummers, which is also recommended in Norman Weinberg's book, Guide to Standardized Drum Set Notation, meaning that the position and type of the note heads are assigned to a particular instrument, and thus to a particular sound. Before we input notes, we deactivate the VST player so we can hear the drum sounds during input. Now we start by inputting the closed hi-hat on every beat. We select the note value and the necessary note head, in this case the cross. In earlier editions of Forte, the note heads can be selected underneath the note values. Next, we want to write bass drum and different toms. Those are input with the regular note heads. The bass drum can be found in the bottom space of the staff, the toms in further positions in the system. With the note head square, we can also add a vibra slap. When you write music, it's of course important to keep an overview at all times. This is why it can make sense to input some of the percussion instruments into a separate system. So we add another instrument. Select Percussion, Add, and OK. Then we double click onto the newly added system to open the Properties window. In Name and Type, we can find the option to insert a particular instrument and also to choose this instrument for MIDI replay. Forte allows you to set note positions for particular percussion instruments yourself. To customize the position of an instrument, click Score and then Drum slash Notation on the far right. Now select the instrument whose position you'd like to alter and choose the new position. When you change the number of the position, you'll see feedback about your changes directly on the graphic interface. It's also possible to spread notes into further parts or assign a new note head if this contributes to a clearer layout of your score. Please bear in mind that those changes cannot be applied to scores already written. It's also important to remember that all settings will have to be reset manually. Keeping these factors in mind can help you create a professional score. Enjoy working with Forte!